I don't know if you've noticed, but we're back in the medical ward, by the way. Wait, we were here before? Yes. Where was I? We're, was I, mean, I in space? We're back in the medical ward, okay? I taught you um, about the phrase space cadet. Yeah, uh, I thought it was, I thought it was like a way to say that someone is like fun loving and eager and like ready to work. Well, and I said Careful. Uh shoot. There you go. So we saw a couple guys that were kind of like that before. And uh they've uh, they've just gotten worse. Uh and I said no, space cadet is usually a way to refer to um Why am I back here? Because we need something from here? No. My money. Um, Space Cadet is a way to refer to as, like, someone who's kind of, like, spacey, not here. They're, like, uh... How do you say it? Um... Aloof. Um... Get off the boat, get off the boat, get off the boat. <laughs> um, what did I need from here? Okay. Have you listened to any of the dialogue for the last... I have. It is not sticking. That's fair, because most of it is like, Isaac, we're incapable of wiping our own asses. Can you go get some toilet paper? Okay, hold on. Once you get the chemicals, you're also going to need a DNA sample of the alien tissue. Is this to help the poison? Yes. Okay. Okay. We're making an we're making a poison to help the poison. Specifically, what Isaac's we're doing poison. is there is a there is infectious tissue in the air, which isn't really poisonous to us, but it will infect us. And your stupid spacesuit only has 70 seconds of air. Yeah. Chemical research lab. You know, that's an actual thing. Um, I was in the molecular lab today, and five weeks ago, during, like, the height of the second, you know, second height of COVID, when they're getting about... Mm, we record these far in advance, by the way. Getting, the, getting about... I don't want to be here. I'm hearing like background, like. I'm not supposed to be in here. Call my wife. Do you hear that? Some real outlast shit. You were explaining space cadet? Uh, no, I was explaining in my molecular in the molecular lab. I'm training in. Wait, before you do that, look at these guys. Hello, Resident Evil. Yeah, but did you hear that note? Uh, people are getting tortured and turned into these guys. Somebody is putting necromorph tissue directly into the bodies of living adults. What the fuck, man. They do PCR, polymerase chain reaction, where they take some nucleic acid and amplify it to see, you know, if someone has, um, you know, some type of, you know, infectious process going on. Your fight for survival is admirable, but pointless. Uh, and yet you keep on going. It almost makes me think that we have fallen species. Am I the only one who sees that? This guy looks like he was pulled out of Dishonored. I'm here. Where, who are you talking? Oh, does he? Does he track? I guess. I think so. Yeah. Behind you. <sighs> okay, not not the right gun. Uh, 
I want the saw. Get him. Yeah, yeah. And get it into his limbs, yeah. Oh my god, he's so tough, though. Good, yeah, create space. Look back at him. Oh, I didn't know these showed up here. Run where? Behind you, that door, yep. Yep. Um, so I think a technique that you can use in two is that you can cut here? off some limbs, probably. Oh, for the love of smi- sh fuck. Oh, it's going bad to worse. Okay, make sure you're heading the right way, though. Thank you. Wait, are they even following me? Yes. No, I'm in the safe room. That that means very little. So anyway, um, if we have a bunch of, uh. DNA that can contaminate a sample and you want to make sure one sample doesn't contaminate another because just a little bit of you know DNA can make things positive so they saw a rate that was six times higher than their normal rate of positivity and they're like okay now we have to bleach the entire lab from top to bottom um anyway it's just one of those things where it's like you there's so much just DNA and stuff floating in the air, and like obviously it's not gonna hurt you too fucking much, cause I mean we're breathing it in right now, aren't we? But uh, you know what? When you're trying to do lab stuff, <laughs> it's a fucking problem. Some of these things you can kill, by the way. Oh, I can. Yes, it's just the one with big glowing eyes. What? Why can't I get past there? Probably you have a puzzle to do. Okay. You're running into a table. Should I just kill him? Some of these things you can kill. Which but one? But they're a lot slower. Normal Necro? Oh, uh, that's, you're a, dead. that's a death. Amazing death sequence, by the oh, way. Oh, yeah, this game is, again, Space RE4, but all of the, like, grab deaths are really good. Um, I'm glad I saved. <laughs> Hopefully they'll checkpoint you, yep. Uh, so there's poison in the air. What's it doing to us? Uh, it's infectious tissue. Okay. And we're just breathing it in. Well, you aren't. Who's breathing it in? Kendra and Hammond. Oh, they don't have a suit? No. If you remember, you're the only one with a helmet. So if you look, you can see that that battery is sparking. Mm -hmm. And then hit your breadcrumbs? I know. No. So I don't know what this means. They're here, by the way. I'm looking for a battery somewhere. Hard I don't me. know. But the fact that it is sparking makes me think that it would be important. Okay, he's dead. I don't think the Ripper at its current level of upgrade can kill that thing fast enough, so it might be good to switch to the contact beam. Is that the contact beam? Yep. Point at him. Make some space. Point at him. Charge up. Okay. Might also be good to kill that thing. Oh, fuck. I don't know how to use it. Do you want me to show you? Give me one second. Can I, mean, I pause this game? At any time. There you go. Oh. That makes some space, doesn't it? Uh, uh. Fuck me. Oh, you fucker. 
All right, your turn. Okay, contact beam. Oh you wow, point they're both getting me. Look at that. Contact beam, you point and charge up, right? Yeah. It's just such a small space that I don't. I don't feel like I don't have time. Like it's not the move. Yeah. Oh wow, this recording's two hours. Yeah, we've been recording for two hours. Have fun with that editing. Uh, I'm gonna at least gonna have to chop this into three. Uh, uh, excuse Where's me. Where's big guy at? Found Incoming. Him. Fuck you. So Isaac will stop if you interrupt his thing. Oh, fat guy. I wonder if they just keep coming. Nice. So the, the charge isn't huge. Can you blast the floor? Uh, yeah, I'll show you. How do you do it again? Aim and RB. See? Hard knockdown. And then that makes a lot of space, so you can deal with it. Nice. It also deals damage and softens them up, making them easier to kill and cut. Okay, I feel like more of these guys have regenerated. Someone keeps shutting down the door protocol. Oh, it's just a straight up fight. Okay, so you're supposed to wait it out. Weird. Do you want me to kill you? Uh, no. Okay. Here, I can take it from here. <laughs> We're just trying to pass it off. Um, thank you, Alfred, for making it to where this LP doesn't drag and drag and drag. I try. So if you notice that this is actually the old node door, and now new things have opened up. I probably just shouldn't be lollygagging in here, huh? He can't get in here. It's fine. You. So something we've talked about. Sarah's definitely going to play Dead Space 2. And I will say, Dead Space 2 actually has some better controls. Um, so contact beam ammo is light. Which is to say, you don't get a lot of it. It's now probably your rarest ammo drop. Sure thing. Um, but as you can see, it blasted a regenerator. And he had to work on just getting his legs back for like 30 seconds before he could even get close to you. Is he following me? I don't think so. There's no music. But down this hallway, something might grab you, so. Just in case. Be Fill careful time, hurry. about overusing that. What do you mean? Oh, shoot it at that. That's a man. Like, that yell, that's not a monster yell. That is a, that's a dude. That's that sound that one guy uh, made when he was buried. His friends uh, tricked him into thinking he was buried. Oh, yeah, yeah. Kiyu. Uh, oh, just this prank. I didn't get all that I money. Hmm? I didn't get all that money I left behind. I grabbed some of it. Oh, thank you. Uh, just a prank I heard about where this guy has claustrophobia, so they fucking got a coffin and pulled the top off and just put it on top of him. Cruel. Yeah. Really fucking cruel. Oh, I can't. I'm hallucinating. Got it. Am I? Is this a person? Hold on, look at the corpse on the floor. Look at her face. Is this the same person? Yeah, it looks like the same person. Same clothes, at least. Same hairstyle, I think. Okay, this is... I'm trying to put her back into bed. It looks like she's stuck, dear. Okay, well... You're also desecrating the dead anyway. Oh my god. Money, though. Yeah, money. <laughs> I'm sorry for your loss. What loss? Of life. I'll grant you that. Man, what the fuck? Look at these beds. Holy shit. Oh god, it looks like somebody melted. Maybe. This is a skin sack, yeah. Yeah, it looks like... You know the tissue you have over your brain like it's eluding me right now but that's what it looks like there's a there's like a sheath around your brain oh um i mean when you say sheath in the context of you brain, think of I, myelin sheath yeah I, I was gonna say i think of like an axon or something um 
you. Why do you keep doing that? He scared me. They are creepy. Sorry, that is all shiny. Uh, X-ray people. I love this Resident Evil show, by the way. Mm -hmm. I love weird science. It's a good movie, too. Um, and a good, I want to say Danny Elfman song, I think. What was I going to say to you? I Talking about weird science? Do 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 do. Persona, Dr. Chalice Mercer. The specimen continues to respond well to my experiments. Its cellular fortitude, not to mention elasticity, is remarkable. Dr. Kai, I'm sure, would disapprove. But I do not anticipate that issue as the good doctor is busying himself with what the. What dialect is this? If that no idea. Now. He has also succumbed to the same dementia that afflicted the colony. Only Those are heads. Mm -hmm. He has spoken to his wife, but Amelia Kine has been dead for some years. Do they just make sure to bring everyone who is either religious nuts, trauma survivors, or both? Patience. Your time is soon. Very soon. So I'm going to run out of limb here and say you probably have to breathe carefully. And you did get a couple of air tanks just now. Um, I want to say they always. This has gone far enough. Accept your part in the God's plan. Embrace your own <laughs> Okay. Yeah, there you go. Isaac, he's decompressed the entire deck, and I'm being locked out of those systems. All the air has been vented in space. You should be able to bring it back on Miss, can I know where to go like while you're have much time? Um I love Wait, uh, there's line racks. Don't they? Left. Here? Um is that a baby? Just a head. Baby doll, in fact. No. Oh god, it's a fetus, you're right. That's that's probably the rawest thing. 